Hi there, this is Paju Monroe, and I am your host for Uncensored Pillow Talk. I am here with my wonderful co-host, Kyle Andrew. Yay! But I think you're wearing too much clothes. Can you take that shirt off, please? Thank you. You sure can. You're so nice. Yes. And also, I have here something, not something, but someone that is very dear to your heart. We have Dakari! Hey! Hi, baby. How you doing? Hi, Baju. I'm doing great. How about you? I am good. Yeah. I am sad that you finally, you know... Yeah, and we, we got engaged again, actually. You I didn't just... hear about the second engagement. <laughs> I know, I, you made me feel bad already. I don't yeah, so we don't need to, I'll your tell you later. But... Beautiful story of yeah. <laughs> your life, how amazing it is. But uh, thank you so much for being here today. But do yeah, you want anything to drink? You. Because um, everything is better when we are tipsy. Any alcohol is great. Wine, or there was some kamikaze sounding drink that sounded just good. Just the cachaça. Oh, cachaça. Yeah, yeah. the yeah. cachaça. And I'll have a Coke Zero, please. Thank you so much. Zero, yes. Yes. So, um, tell me, like, very quickly, how you guys met. Uh, we met in Guerneville. Yeah. Which do you know where that is? <laughs> I am the ESL Barbie, but I know where Guerneville. Yeah. So we met at a pool party. It was like the last day of uh, summer camp. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Were you working there? Were you doing your? No, I was just there having fun, and then we were like making out with people by the pool, and then we turned around and we started making out with each other. I love. I love. And that you was say making out with people. Yeah. There were other. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. I love my gay life. Yeah. Yes. So when it was you saw a party. Him, when you saw him, did you get drawn like right away to that beautiful face and all those sets of teeth that are his? <laughs> they yeah, are. They are all real. It was just like super like dead set. It was eyes full of life. Uh -huh. Yeah. <laughs> thank you. Thank you so much, Sterling. Thank I you. got you in a second. Oh, is are those, is that Chad? Yes. Oh my God. Do you, we got some of those for. Uh, Where's the little Chad? Oh, there we go. Yeah, you, you got just it. Want to come between my I legs, do you? come between yes. you. Oh, it's actually Brad. <laughs> That's Brad. You know, they all look alike. Yeah. They all, Chad, all Brad. boys. They all boys. Yeah. So, um, <clears throat> tell me one thing. So, um, if you look here, oh, yeah. does this look familiar to you? He, you know, this man yeah, actually it's also looks. <laughs> It's, yeah, the background of my phone. Um, <laughs> no, it's not. So you, you created this. I did, yes. I did. Let's talk about what you do for a living. Yeah. Which is absolutely amazing. Yeah. Um, you're a photographer. Well, not only a photographer. You are kind of you, a sweetie. woman show. You do everything. So yeah. tell me about it. I mean, yeah, I, I, I love doing portraits of people. I have a wedding photography business, event photography, um, but... Portraits are my jam. That's where my passion is. Mm -hmm. um, working. This is kind of a part of the Essence series yes. that I'm working on. And uh, yeah, so it, it was actually a perfect uh, mixture of like your request and what I was working yeah. on. So it was like kind of a perfect storm uh, for that for that photo shoot. Amen. Yeah. And he shot me as well. I'm like, and it was just like so fucking amazing. Yeah. <laughs> but when she showed up, she was so tall. Oh. We had to get a ladder to climb up on. I had to get. A, I had a ladder. I had to get a ladder. Um, on your professional life, what was something that stood out like throughout the years? You know, um, I mean, I've done like events for like. Amazon and things like mm -hmm. that, which were, that kind of sparked this whole series was yeah. this portrait studio that I set up for Amazon. Um, but, you know, I don't really, I like all the more intimate uh, portraits that I do with people. Mm -hmm. Like, those are, those are really the most fun to me. Like, the actual big events that I do mm -hmm. and that are, like, paying me a lot of money, I don't, they're not as, they don't bring me as much joy. Right. Yeah, uh-huh. No, I, I understand. And yeah. you say you do weddings, you do, of, of course, you do gay weddings. Of course, yeah. <laughs> and, um, and I love that, that part. Um, have you watched Sex in the City 2? No, not yet. Oh my god! I've seen it. Cut it! You've seen it? You know how Sarah just, like, uh, big, true. keeps on saying, oh, I'm on a gay wedding, and Sarah Jessica Parker is like, um, <laughs> it is just a wedding, and then suddenly they come out and it's like, full on swans and uh, <laughs> they're, they're very ahead of the, yeah. and, they're, they're, and they look at each other and like yeah this is a gay wedding <laughs> this is a gay wedding I don't want to reveal too much on camera but we have some pretty fabulous plans for our wedding which I don't want to give away because I don't mm -hmm. want other people doing them Aww. but it will be a gay wedding oh <laughs> are you going to have don't, swans? Don't, don't say anything don't, don't, don't it's not say my place you're the guest uh -huh. what? <laughs> do you have a do you have any questions for yeah your I have a couple questions so what are <laughs> What's one thing that you remember as being, you know, extremely difficult in your journey uh, to be where you are today? 
A lot of people don't know this, um, but I was actually homeless and I lived in a car for two years of my life. Oh, yeah, yeah, and that was definitely something that I overcame and it was just a matter of uh, really just keep going. Like I, my passion was photography and I didn't mm. want to give that up uh, for anything. And just I just I just followed my path and I was going yeah. to events and living in my car and going from event to event and mm -hmm. shooting events and portraits and um, until it, my business finally like picked up to the point where it kind of exploded. But yeah, for like two, just, two years, just... now I'm wearing the diamond ties. <laughs> <laughs> cool. um, so let's do a little Q&A, but first, do you want to take us off off? Let's get them on, please. <laughs> <laughs> The thing that you don't know at home is that mm -hmm. um, when I get in here and I strip down, I think it is very cold. I think this thing is so hot. And she walks in and she's like, oh, dra drag slick for <laughs> like two minutes. I mean, it's always like a tug of war with the heater with, between us. Um, <laughs> let's do a little Q and A. Yeah. So I'll just I'll say a, I'll say something and it's whatever comes in your mind. Oh, she's thirsty and I love it. Wow, that's okay. Done. And, uh, we'll fix, we'll fix um, that. Life. Death. Um, death. Drag. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why. Future. I Present. Um, if you would have received an obscene amount of money tomorrow, what would yeah. be the first thing you would you would do? The first thing. Yeah. Put some in my retirement account, which has zero dollars in it. Oh my God! You're so <laughs> responsible. Uh, relationship. Yeah. Um, relationships? What about it? What do you think about relationships? Um, Kyle. <laughs> That's what I think. <laughs> what do you think? <laughs> yeah. See, I can't, I can't top that. Stop. No, you can't. Here. You're not going to be allowed to. You could bottom yeah. that, though. Okay. <laughs> How can somebody contact you? Uh, on to... Instagram at Dakari, D-A-K-A-R-A-I. Mm -hmm. uh, or um, if you know my cell phone number, you can call me personally. Thank you so much for being thank here. You thank you so thank much you, for you, having me. You. Yeah. Kyle! Oh my and God! Thank you, Kyle. <laughs> I'm empty. Thank you I for love it. You, you, you got it right. You, like, you locked that pussy and you're like... He did. Mine. Yeah, he like did. The yes. it's proof. Well, thank you so much for everything, guys. And I'll <laughs> see you next week. Bye!